It's a scary moment for some high schoolers after dozens of shots were fired not far from a freshman baseball game. And it happened right by St. Rita High School that's on Chicago's southwest side. CBS 2's Mugo Digwe has been detailing what we know now. Students are back in class this morning. We tried speaking with a school administrator on camera, but that request was denied. They did say they'd have a statement about the shooting later today. This is the moment the players finally realized the sound they were hearing was in fact gunshots. You can see some of them dropped to the ground. At least 20 gunshots could be heard during that time. St. Rita's freshman baseball coach says this was an isolated incident that happened on Western Avenue, not on school property. In fact, he says both baseball games were completed and that the track team continued after the shooting. According to Chicago police, the shooting was just before 520 last night. An SUV drove by the McDonald's right next to St. Rita High School, and someone inside that SUV started shooting. A woman in Alexis told police her car was hit as she was in the drive through Five other parked cars were hit as well. We spoke with a St. Rita High grandparent on Friday morning. She tells us her grandson and her daughter were across the street at a nearby station when the shooting started. And all of a sudden, they saw this car pull up, and they started shooting toward McDonald's. So they got to ducking and everything like that. So it was really terrifying. You know, I know it's no place really safe, but we really thought this was, you know, this area was really safe. But it happens anywhere. No one was injured in the shooting, but police say they are still searching for the person responsible. Outside St. Rita High School, Magoldi Way, CBS 2 News.